How's it going everyone? In this video, I'll show you how to create high resolution 300 DPI images from Canva for high quality printing. This is useful if you use Canva for creating designs for clothing, merchandise, or for printing marketing materials. DPI in printing stands for dots per inch. A higher DPI means a higher resolution and therefore a higher dot density. This will give you a higher print quality. 300 DPI is the standard print quality a lot of professional printers will ask for and is suitable for most commercial applications. The problem with Canva is that when you download the PNG it only produces a 120 DPI image or a 96 DPI image for JPEGs. You can check the DPI of a picture by right clicking the file name, properties, then details. You can then see the horizontal and vertical DPI. Alternatively, you can open the image in Paint, click File, Properties, and you can see this JPEG is only 96 DPI. According to Canva, we can get 300 DPI images by selecting the PDF Print option and then downloading. However, if we have uploaded low resolution images to the picture, it will still result in a low quality. So. What we need to do is take this PDF print file and convert it to a high quality JPEG. If you are sending to a professional printer, they may also need the crop marks and bleed. Click download, then head over to pdf to jpeg.net. Choose a PDF file to upload it. Then select excellent 300 DPI. then click convert PDF to JPG and download that file. Now, when we open the image in paint, the JPEG will be 300 DPI. Another issue with Canva is that all the downloads use the RGB color profile instead of CYMK. RGB refers to the primary colors of light, red, green, and blue, which are used in pixels of monitors, TV screens, and phone screens. CYMK refers to the primary colors of pigment, cyan, magenta, yellow, and black, which are the four colors of printing. K in this case stands for key. Hence why you usually have four ink cartridges in your color printer. So what you see on your monitor is not what you'll see on print. Hence, we need to also convert the file from RGB to CMYK. You can do this by going to RGB to CYMK.org and converting your image. Firstly, upload your file, select JPEG. You can use the default settings for the rest and then click Start. As you can see on here, the two images look slightly different. There you go, now you should have a print ready image in 300 dpi with a CYMK color profile. Hopefully that was useful to you and helped you understand the printing process a bit better. Let me know in the comments if you have any further printing advice for beginners, otherwise feel free to like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next one.